when I retired from my first career and started my second career in the steel pipe business, I had one day of formal training, just barely enough to figure out the weight of a piece of pipe. Uh, wishing I had some form of training, uh, I think I could have moved along a lot quicker and made fewer mistakes. One of the big benefits of the NASPD is the education program. It was started a few years ago by a very hardworking group of members. It's evolved into a wonderful um, benefit for all the members and even people outside of the industry. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the sixth annual presentation of the Steel Pipe Basic Education Course. This is presented by the National Association of Steel Pipe Distributors. The the steel pipe distribution business is made up of many mid-size and small companies, which gives young people an opportunity to uh, make a good career and make uh, good money for their family. Uh, but in order to do this, you have to uh, train yourself well and prepare yourself for the future. So uh, we offer this training course for people to come and get an idea of what is involved in steel pipe. And uh, once you see this, you will prob you'll probably learn more in the two days that we teach you than you could learn in two years uh, without this course. Um, we're here today for the NASPD training course. And the purpose of this course, this course evolved about seven or eight or nine years ago. And the idea was to allow new entrants into our, uh, into our industry to jumpstart their careers, to allow them to learn more about the technical aspects of producing steel, making pipe, specifications, all kind of non-technical issues like how do you ship something and how do you figure volume, how do you figure weight per foot and how, what's a mill test report mean and what are the different type of coatings that can be put on pipe for its usage. So the idea is to take someone fairly new to the industry and jumpstart their career a year or two so they become much more beneficial uh, as employees and much more productive to our members. This course here is one of the few places, actually it's the only place that's out there that you can learn about this in a safe environment without someone yelling at you or without having a problem, without having a mistake, and in and, and just a couple of days get a tremendous w amount of knowledge that literally took me 15 years to gather. You can gather literally here in two days. The course is important because we can, uh, in two days, show you the production of steel, uh, the raw materials for steel pipe, uh, the how all of the pipe is made. We go over the specifications for the uh, uh, most used steel pipe, and we show you uh, how we coat pipe, and we also teach you about quality control. Uh, it's very difficult to get all of these people in one room to teach you, and uh, sometimes your companies uh, don't have the resources to present this for you. So we offer this to uh, the companies in the industry and also those that want to come engineers uh, that are outside of our in uh, industry so that you can get a basic overview of the steel pipe. And that's actually one of the things that's good about this course. They actually take you to a pipe mill and never pass up a chance to go to a pipe mill, whether it's seamless pipe or threading or heat treating or anything. Always go see a manufacturing operation because that's where you learn things, actually walking through it. There are people like me throughout the industry that come together. We have a specialist for coding whose family's been in the coding business for 40 plus years. We have people that have been in the structural pipe business for a very long time. We have an expert that has been in oil country tubular goods for his whole adult life. So it's not just one person teaching this course. There's specialists in each area that have knowledge, that bring their education, that bring their knowledge, that bring their experience of 30, 40 years experience each to chair with the students. And in a two-day period in this course, you probably don't have access to the resources and the level of knowledge and experience of the instructors that are here gathered together to help you grow in your knowledge and foundation of pipe and tube products. If the students coming in here today are brand new, they will get a full overview of the steel and pipe industry. Um, I think that the takeaway for them is on um, knowing a lot about the products, how they're made, how the raw materials are sourced, but even more than that, they know that there's a group of industry experts. Now they have contacts, people they can call if they have questions, people that they can call to get them out of some trouble. And it's good, it's always good to make contacts in the industry, especially when you're young in your job. You have to know 
what you're doing. You have to know what you're selling because a lot of times, uh, especially in this industry, you're dealing with customers who are essentially contractors where they're not pipe specialists, so you are their pipe specialist. You've got to speak the language. If you're going to sell somebody something, if, if you're Chinese selling America, you've got, you got to speak English. Well, I'm in the oil country two-bitter goods and line pipe business, and they have their own language. Now, it's English, but it's a jargon that you have to understand and that the, your customers aren't going to teach you. They just expect you to know it. And so you have to know how to, you have to understand what they're saying or you're, you're just going to be lost. I, I think it has a lot of information. I'm on the operation side. I've never been on the sell side of the industry, but it has a lot of information, a lot of things that I wasn't aware of, and it makes you think a lot. Just things that are made of steel and, you know, that you never really think about. So it's, it's been really interesting. Recently, I've hired a new uh, vice president of sales and marketing who was in a different industry, came into this industry, and sent him to the program even though he didn't need it from a professional standpoint. It gave him a lot of the background and lingo and things that are used within the industry that are important to know. Very valuable. I have uh, a sales rep that just started f with me, or started working for me. Uh, and he's never done any pipe and tube, and we're going to throw him into it. And I think this is a great place for him to go. See, I only need to know a little bit. He needs to know a lot. So that's what I pay him to do. You know, you, you just want to know, anytime you have more knowledge than your competitor, and that, that itself, I mean, that gives you an advantage.